work hard, and um, we just got to learn from it, you know. Um, every day is a learning experience, and we just got to learn from our mistakes today and go from there. Guys, you guys kind of got off to a, a bit of a slow shooting start. Do you think there was some nerves surrounding the game, or what do you think the reason behind that was? Um, there definitely are always nerves in the beginning of the game, any game you play. Um, but I think, you know, we kept our composure and we came back, you know, eventually. And then um, I just with that, we just got to play. We, the shots were there, so it was just kind of playing through it and get back on defense and trying to get another, another off offensive op opportunity. What kind of stuff do you think Coach is going to really hammer on in practice after this game and, and in the film sessions? Um, definitely handling the pressure of Nebraska. They were a full-court pressuring team, um, rebounding. Um, offensively and defensively, and um, you know, just executing and you know, getting the shots we want. How much did you feel like that pressure kind of wore on you guys, or took its toll on you guys a little bit? That constant defensive pressure. Um, it was definitely difficult, um, but I think you know, at times we did handle it very well. It's just um, you know, getting into it and just making sure that we execute what we want. Does kind of wear you down mentally to kind of stay focused against that kind of pressure for? 40 minutes. It definitely does. So, you know, we got we to gotta stay uh, together as a team, communicate on the floor, and communicate in the huddles. Coach, you talk, go ahead. Can you talk about uh, Yasmin's performance tonight and, and how she battled through um, the ankle injury? Uh, yeah, she um, definitely fought through it, and I'm proud of her for doing that. Um, of course, you can't, you know, ask somebody to play with a broken whatever. You know, she did her best, and, you know, we appreciate that. And we had some people step up in her position, which was great. So, Coach has maintained since, you know, before the season started that this year isn't about wins and losses. Mm -hmm. uh, but as a player, sort of um, walking away from that game, um, sort of what do you take away? Does it mean more to you with the score like that or just not as much? Because you guys have changed the culture. You know, we saw you diving on the floor for loose balls, you know, even when you're down by, you know, 30 points. Um, that type of game is kind of just you – you just got to play to the buzzer ends. Um, you know, it was tough, uh, but you kind of have to ignore the score and just play basketball and, you know, try to chip back. So in that kind of situation, you just got to play to the buzzer ends. Do you think – go ahead. <laughs> kind of disappointed in the final score, but kind of talk about individually. You had a good game Sunday and then another good game. Kind of where's your confidence level at and how much has it improved over the course of this year? Um, well, thank you. But I, I definitely think um, my role has – um, I have to step up when I when my call is needed, and um, my teammates are helping me with that. And I think um, just these last two games, we've come together, even though the score wasn't what we wanted, but we still came together at the end. And I think that was good for us. So I, I give all my credit to my teammates. That's one. Do you think? Do you think last year this team would have fought back like this, uh, like you did tonight? Last year was a different atmosphere. Um, I can't say we did, we would have, or we wouldn't. Um, but you know, this is a new era, and we're fighting to the end. And we we have a mission, and we have a goal, and we're looking towards the future. We, you know, this game was tough, but we got to look to tomorrow.